when life is easy and when things are going well, people don't need God, they don't need Jesus, they disregard Him, they shun Him, they mock Him. But when things really go bad, when all hope fails, then people start looking for God. Then they start crying out to God. They start looking for Jesus. They run to churches. They run to people whom they regard as men and women of God. But only God can help us. Only Jesus Christ can help us. However, we have to go to Him on His terms. We have to repent of our wickedness and obey Him, or else He will not hear our prayers. God is a, not just a convenience or a spare wheel. We cannot just run to God when we run out of all other hope and all other resources. We have to seek Him in the good times, and He will be with us in the bad times. Many people will cry out, and the heavens will be brazen. They will be close to them. They, they will not get an answer. It is their sin that separates them from God. Many churches and many people will call for prayer meetings, but God will not answer because their sin separates them from God. If we do not repent and remove our abominations before the face of God, those things that separate us from God, He will not answer our prayers. We have to come to Him on His terms, repent and turn away from our wickedness, our sins, and those things that we have loved and treasured more than Him, or else He will not hear us. But if we truly repent and turn away from wickedness, if we come to Him with a contrite heart, with sorrow over our sins, really sorry for our wickedness, and we plead Him for forgiveness, he will answer and He will hear us. There comes a time when the door will close, when people will call out to God and He will not answer. Today is the day of salvation. Now is the time to call on Jesus. If you repent and remove your sins from you now, and you come to Jesus now, and you obey Him now, repent and be baptized and seek Him with all your heart, then He will fill you with the Holy Spirit and you can live in the presence of God. God takes care of His children. But if we reject Him now, He will not be with us in the day of our trial and our tribulation. Seek Jesus now while you can. Don't wait until it is too late and you call out and He does not answer you because then He will say to you, when I called, you did not listen. When you call, I will not hear you. Today is the day of salvation. Repent, stop sinning, turn from your wicked ways, seek Jesus with all your heart, be baptized in water, Obey Jesus Christ. Seek the baptism of the Holy Spirit, the presence of God in your life, and then follow and obey the guidance of the Holy Spirit. And God will be with you. Are you with God? Or have you rejected Him? May Jesus bless you.